Hello and welcome to uh, History 254, History Shortened and Walker 254. Um, today we look at the Spider-Man of Paris and to see what happened to him. Mamadou Gassama was passing through a neighborhood in northern Paris on his way to watch the Champions League final between Liverpool and Real Madrid on television. As he walked along the Rio Marx dormy, he spotted a crowd looking up at a residential building. They were looking at a small boy dangling from the edge of a fourth floor balcony, at times by only one hand, where a neighbor tried desperately to reach him over a partition. As some would later say he didn't have time to think, he just acted. He reached the lowest balcony, stood on it, and leaped up, somehow without falling back before grabbing hold of the edge of the next balcony up and repeating the same trend. The crowd below cried, go fast, go fast, as he made his way up the side of the building where the boy's grip appeared to start firing. Failing, within only seconds of the start of the journey, Gassama reached the fourth floor balcony. He then swept the boy up with one hand, bringing him back up, bringing back down on the safe side of the balcony. As he did so, the crowd erupted in cheers and mobile phones. Footage showed the traffic had stopped as everyone looked up. Within half a day, that footage was being shared and broadcasted around the world. As the film of the amazing rescue sp spread around the world, so too did the praise of Gassama's bravery. When it emerged that Gassama was an illegal immigrant, originally from Mali, French President Emmanuel Macron announced he would be made a naturalized citizen and gave him a medal for his courage. The mayor of Paris did the same, and the city's firefighters went on to offer him an internship on which he began early that December. His exploits have even been eroded in song by the singer and comedian Sagalav. As he sings, he climbed first floor, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, all the way up to an imaginary twelfth floor. His song also references Lassan Bartheri, who in January 2015 hid customers from a gunman who attacked the Paris kosher supermarket where he worked. Like Gassama, Bartheri is also from Mali and was also made a French citizen after his brave actions. The two met in the days after Gassama's rescue and Badri was able to give him advice on how to unhandle their attention. Gassama since then has made few appearances over the year and in June he was handed a humanitarian prize at the Brack Entertainment Television Awards in Los Angeles. Among others to be awarded that night were the cast of uh, Black Panther and Beyonce. Naturally shy, Gassama hasn't spoken much publicly since the rescue and one close friend said he had been a little overawed, overawed by the media attention. Gassama is said to have been making good progress in his job but it's not clear, it has not been clear what would happen after the 10 month contract expired. As his position, he was to be un, at his position, his internship, he was earning $472, dollars, 472 euros, which is equivalent to 426 uh, pound, which is equivalent to $534 for 96 hours of work each month. In September, the boy's father was convicted of neglecting his parental responsibility and made to take course in being a better parent. He and the child have never been publicly identified. As for Gassama, he has now moved out of the hotel in Montreal, eastern Paris, in which he was staying at the time of the rescue, because he now has the official paperwork that comes with gaining French citizenship. He has been able to rent an apartment on his own. If you like this video, click subscribe, like and share. Uh, comment below about your comments and uh, stay notified when we upload future videos. Until next time, bye bye.